Okay guys, so I'm starting off with the Anastasia um, Glow Kit in the shade Gleam and I'm just using the shades Mimosa and Crushed Pearl to highlight my face and I'm going a little overboard with the highlight because this look is a very glowy kind of summer look so that's why I'm going a little overboard with highlight. And here I'm taking MAC Blush in Warm Soul. I really like this blush, especially for a summer look, just because it kind of warms up your face and gives you a more natural look when you're wearing a heavier glam. So here I'm showing you guys the shade Cool Beans, which I swatched. And as you can see, these shades are so pigmented, and I highly recommend... Um, this palette just because it's absolutely stunning and also I'm taking the shade bestie and working it in with transition which just creates a really pretty transition shade for the other colors okay guys now to deepen things up I'm taking the shade are you kidding me teddy bear and wine and dine which are just deeper colors and I'm gonna focus this on the outer corner and kind of work it into my inner corner as well but I'm mainly focusing on the outer and I'm gonna create a really pretty 3d kind of effect on my eyes Okay, and now I'm taking the same shades that I used previously and I'm just taking them under my lower lash line and smoking it out just for a more dramatic look. And then I went back in with the Anastasia Gleam Kit and I used the shade Crush Pearl in my inner corner just because it really highlights my eyes beautifully and I'm putting that in my inner corner and under my brow bone. Taking a nude liquid lipstick, I'm using the NYX Lip Lingeries in the shade Lace Detail, and this is very, very beautiful, especially for this look. It kind of calms it down, but I really love it, and next I'm going to take the Buxom Lip Gloss in the shade Sophia. This just adds a 3D look to my lips and makes it look glossy for this complete look. You guys have seen my mascara routine before, but I'm just taking the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and the Maybelline Rocket Lash for some beautiful long full lashes. And you can use false lashes, but for me, I just try to stay away from false lashes just because they're a little uncomfortable. Okay guys, that is the final look. I really hope you enjoyed and if you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe for more.